Hi, Hiram here. I've had a bunch of questions about how do I start wood fires out on the trail if it's rainy or wet, stuff like that. So I just wanted to show you my uh, things I use. They're called fire wicks. They're basically a candle without all the wax. You just get yourself some uh, braided cotton cord rope. This is about 13 pounds stuff. I've seen or read in other places, a book I'll suggest, where they take cotton cord and then make their own braided rope by twisting. But I had this stuff on hand some years ago and it just never seems to go away. Anyway, basically all you do is you just cut pieces of rope, dip them in melted wax, uh, look at my other video on making survival candles on how I melt the wax from you know things like these tins where I use a uh, candle melter candle heater warmer whatever you want to call it anyway you melt your wax dip these in let them set for a couple minutes so that they soak up all of the uh, wax that they can and then you just cut them into convenient lengths I like to put them in a pill bottle so I cut them to that length and let's just see the difference with this burning versus just the cord itself Now, all you have to do is you just light this fire wick, stick it in your wood, your tinder, whatever. See, the, the string itself won't even stay lit. But depending on the length that you cut these uh, fire wicks out, they can last for several minutes. Enough time for you to get a you know, good fire started. You can dunk these in water, just wipe them off, they'll still light. And this is enough heat that if you have tinder that's somewhat dry, it should finish drying it off and you know make let you be able to start a fire. So that's my fire wicks. If you want more information on something like this, get a hold of this book. Practical Outdoor Projects by Len McDougall. He talks in there about how he starts, he makes his fire wicks. I'm pretty sure this is where I got it from originally. A lot of good stuff in here. A worthwhile book. So anyway, that's fire wicks. That's not even halfway burned through yet. Now, it, wind will put it out, but it'll help you with that wet tinder. So there you go. Fire wicks, one of the fire starters that I use. Something you can make at home, nice and cheap. And there you go. So as always, thanks for watching. I look forward to your input, questions, remarks, suggestions. And watch for Max the Dog. Bye now.